guitar guy gets his gets his bits. What? There's more. Ooh, that's so good. So today we are going to check out a band called Guns N' Roses. Not Guns and Roses, Guns N' Roses. Now, I've heard of Guns N' Roses. Of course I have. I grew up with a brother who listened to Guns N' Roses. The CDs were all over our house. Did I listen to them? No, because that was his thing. Meanwhile, I was in my bedroom trying to sing Phantom of the Opera. Think of me, think of me fancy. And if you're just joining us right now, welcome to my musical education, where I'm learning about bands and singers I should have listened to by now, but I haven't done. A segment of today's video is brought to you by a brand new brand to the channel. Brand new brand. It's Manscaped. Manscaped is trusted by more than 9 million men worldwide for their trimmers, hygiene and shower products, and boxers. You might notice I am not a man. Or maybe you did not notice, but I am not a man. Enter my father, Papa Jennings. The Handyman delivers a quick close shave with its unique dual blade, which can knock down up to three days worth of growth. It features skin safe technology to help reduce nicks and cuts. Bye bye patchy beards and hello clean well groomed appearance. Isn't that right dad? The Handyman is waterproof which helps make cleanup quick and easy. The sleek compact design fits perfectly on your hand so it's easy to maneuver and reach tricky spots. Oh and did I mention it's airplane friendly due to its compact size and rechargeable battery. And it has 60 minutes runtime on a single charge. When the battery level gets low, the indicator blinks, letting you know it's time to recharge. Now guys from Manscaped have given me a special code for you, my people. Just go to manscaped.com, type in the code Diane, and you will get 20% off your purchase of the handyman. Thank you, Manscaped, and indeed to Papa Jennings for supporting this channel. On with the video. Some of you guys wonder where Chewie is sometimes right now. He's over here. He's got his own little seat beside me. Ooh, he, he does not like being upset. He likes his little seat. Good boy. Yeah, you chill there. We're gonna listen to Guns N' Roses. This song is called November Rain. I feel like Guns N' Roses is gonna be like very old school rock and roll. Like that's what I have in mind. Like, <clears throat> I feel like in the back of my head, I probably have heard Guns N' Roses songs. This is their most viewed song. So we'll see if I recognize it. I like the music all set. Peter. Is he blindfolded? No. Okay. Piano. Not what I was expecting. Oh my gosh, his voice is amazing.
Charles Hoodland. There's a tongue there. This is his moment. Love it. Guitar guy gets his gets his bits. I like his hat. Wow! What? There's more? <gasps> oh no! She's passed away in her wedding gown. I love those drums. Whoa! He 
looks a bit like Brad Pitt, doesn't he? Well, that was completely unexpected. It was very theatrical, which I loved. I also loved the infusion of classical instrumentation. Axl Rose, it came back to me at the beginning of the video. I was like, the lead singer's name is Axl Rose, right? Why was he wearing the bandana? Just because he thinks it's cool. It was just his trademark. He managed to make his famous snake dance slivering down to the side. Slivering? He wore his trademark bandana and managed his famous snake dance slithering side to side effortlessly. Rose is... Oh, well, this article was written in 2013, so he's, he was 50 then. Now he's... 60? 59? Matt's is not my strong suit. Or music. His voice, like, was very... And, like, I'm wondering, does he learn how to sing that way? But if he did, then he'd have, like, really bad nodules on his vocal cords. Like, if I did a whole concert like that, that would hurt. Like, it sounded way better than what I just did. But I, I gotta wonder. Oh, okay. Oh, I was right. Vocalist suffered damage to his vocal cords, according to a comment by guitarist Richard Fortas. It led Rose to seek assistance from a vocal coach to address sound issues. Vocal injuries are prevalent among performers, especially those in the music industry. That does not surprise me. Especially if it became like his trademark voice thing. You know, you start to do a little bit of affectation with that. Oh, they sang Sweet Child of Mine. I know that one. Uh Oh, 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 sweet child of mine. Where did the name come from? It's a great name. Like, as, as names go, Guns N' Roses, like, that's, that's a freaking awesome name. Oh, it might sound like the perfect name for an LA rock band, but actually it came about by complete happenstance. It's an amalgamation of two previous bands, Hollywood Rose and LA Guns, that would later become Guns N' Roses. <gasps> the band has changed their lineup 22 times since they started out. So maybe that guitar guy isn't even in the band anymore. He certainly like had a few moments to shine in that music video. Also, the drummer I freaking loved. I always say this. My thing that I like in music is if you could picture it in a Karate Kid movie, then I'll probably like it. Oh, Axl Rose's real name is William Bruce Rose Jr. Oh, Rose is his real name. Anyway, good to check out Guns N' Roses today. When the song first kicked in, I thought it was going to be Purple Rain, like November Rain. I thought it was gonna be a cover of that song we've checked out before on the channel by Prince. But that was very interesting. Good to know now. Guns N' Roses are the band with the guy who goes <laughs> But I liked it. I liked the <laughs> It was very good and I would jam to that. Thank you so much guys. That's it for this video on the inside. Bye.